A night bird that nested underground is not the sincere chain on the southern coast of Western Australia and is not greater than an walnut. The sea biologist Jennifer Lavers describes the white-faced storm Peterini. A bird is very little known. So when local rangers caught first of someone who returned to nesting floor on southern coast of Wa, their reactions were shocked. Then don't rejoice. I swear I squeak like a little boy. And then everyone started laughing. Dr. Dr. Lavers said, I was really caught unprepared. It was a very special moment for everyone. White-faced storm petras migrates from South Wa to the Arab Sea every year Dr. Lavas and Ranges of Esperance Jaljrak domestic title Aborigin are examining the storm petrally to better understand why global seaside populations are in a decline. He said he had revealed his own difficulty. Knowing that birds flying at night and nesting underground during the day will be on the island. Mammoth migration storm petrels. Cousin much larger albatro. Flies 10,000 km migration to winter nesting areas near Arab Sea every year from Recherche. Archipelago. Chain of islands on southern coast Wa. When the birds return to the archipelago. Anywhere between July and October some passed until December. However, as the nesting season approached, Dr. Lavas and the team gambled and set up their cameras in late August scientists and rangers caught the return of the white-faced storm Petrelli using trap cameras. He paid gambling with arrival birds. It was quite unlikely that we could nail the timing of distribution cameras, said. We started to slide in the photos and I think hoam. Nothing will happen. Suddenly bam. A bird appeared on the screen. This small walnut covered at least 8,000 or 10,000 kilometers. Caught in a short moment for first time to land for the first time in months. Although discovery may seem small. Dr. Lavas said that scientists could first say when birds will return every year and allow the team to monitor and monitor future reproductive seasons. Small bird switch of the big problem as birds living in abundance of the ocean. Storm Petras offers researchers a unique opportunity to draw parallels between health and environment of species. Jennifer Lavas says that seabird health is directly related to the health of the oceans. Dr. Lavas said that the storm in Western Australia could serve as a turnusol test to understand larger global environmental problems as ocean guards and indicators of ocean health. If seafood is not particularly good, this usually speaks a lot about the health of local environment. He said, what we want to know is whether our local marine birds in Esperance and the archipelago have fallen. We can't really answer some of these questions right now. White-faced storm petrels lives in Esperance off Recherche Archipelago. Seabird population decrease reducing population of sea is felt in other reproductive areas around world, including N.E.